What is up, guys? And welcome to match two of Division Six finals between Hev uh, between Hell's Kitchen and and Luminescence. HK took match one by about eighty points or so, but we're trying. We're, we're hoping to see Ellie send us to match three to and see if they can even it up here. And I will be casting. I. I'm here casting today, and I'll be casting with X Will. Hello. How are you doing, Will, today? I am doing great. I am very excited to see how these matches will go on. This is match two of the Grand Star Cup Season 6. Uh, no, not Season 6. Division 6 final, sorry. And HK is up 1-0 going to the series. So I'm very excited to see how this will uh, finish off. Vinny. Yeah, for sure. Um, for for HK, their lineup will be Dizzy, Rock Dude, Snoopy, 4J, and dino bagging um i feel like this is pretty standard for for hk ford hasn't played um every match but he has subbed in here and there and he has come up big for them um so i think he'll i i, I so, so i think he'll be able to so, to fill in nicely and and help out hk to win this match and win it 2-0 but though they'll, they'll probably have rock dude up there at the front the most he he tends to pop off quite a bit usually up at the front is a good playmaker too, and he he has some good support as well in Fizzy, who has improved a lot over the season. And same with Snoopy, we've seen Snoopy both bag and run, but he's pretty good in both departments. Um, what are your thoughts on this uh, on this lineup, uh, um, Will? Well, obviously I'm a little biased towards the lineup, but I do know how good each and every single one of these players are in this lineup. This is a very good lineup coming up for Hell's Kitchen, probably one of their best. Uh, Fizzy, obviously, he's probably one like I would debatably the best player. I'll put him up there. On the team right now so you know he's gonna be up there in the front he's gonna be doing most of the frontal presence and then you know rock dude he comes he's here every now and then he's a great team player he's very consistent he might not be the fastest but what he does when he's up there he stays up there he doesn't get hit he doesn't hit back stamps he's obviously gonna be up there snoopy is a runner who's like gotten better over time he went from bagging converted to running and you know he's been getting up there especially like in lounge he's been getting his rank up he's been getting a lot more high dip practice so he's definitely gonna be one to pop off and 4j is the most recent player to uh out of this squad been playing the game and he's been improving like rapidly very quickly so i could see him you know having a dominating performance as he did have a really strong performance on the last match of gsc i think dropping like 120 against CY if I'm not mistaken or something like that. So and what I'm saying, Vinny, is basically any one of these players on this luster can basically pop off. And so it's gonna be a really strong match for Ellie to see how, how they compete. Yeah, no doubt about it. No doubt about it. Um Ellie's gonna have their money's worth and I guess switching over to LE lineup now. We're going to have Nubly, Mike, um Spirit, Landon, and I believe their sub is um who who Yudo. do they have something for Dignam? Yudo, yeah, Yudo Utopia. and Yudo will be bagging. I believe for this and Landon match. will um, be running. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yep. So a little bit different. We've seen Landon once again. He both bags, uh, kind of and runs. He's kind of been Ellie's main bagger this season, but Udo, um, d does have bagging experience too. Although I'm not sure if he'll be a little rusty or not because he hasn't played that much this season, if at all. Um, but for Ellie, um, their their big X factor, their big carry is definitely Mike. Mike, um has been in the top three um as far as it is an mvps in d6 for at least the past two seasons in a row now um i played against him quite a bit in this div and he always scores and he always scores extremely well in these matches always breaks 100 it seems and and he, he's definitely going to be the key to le sending this to a match three it's going to have to be him scoring well but also nubbly scoring well too as nubbly is a very strong runner in d6 for sure so it's going to have to be both him and Mike up at the front carrying it for Ellie and hopefully Yudo can get get, get at least some shocks against Dino um but that, that that's really their keys is to sending this um um to a third match yeah uh, I like this Ellie lineup that they're running out here it's surprising because you would think that they would run you know uh use their uh, best well I wouldn't say their best player but he's definitely the team leader so I don't want to see how that fares up for them because they did lose the first match without him but uh, I don't think they were running as good of a lineup as they are right now. As you know, Nubly, strong runner. He recently came back to play this GSC season. Uh, he's been performing pretty well. You know, Mike, obviously the D6 carry. He uh, he MVP'd last season. I don't know if he's MVPing this season. I don't think so. But he's definitely like probably in the top 10. And then, you know, Deacon, he's a very strong, solid runner. So obviously just from those three love, like you're going to have a very tough competition if you're HK. 
And then Landon, who's a bagger, main, usually bags for the team, but this time he's going to be running today. Landon, he is a good runner when he isn't uh, getting upset, but when he is keeping a cool, calm mind, he is very strong up there, and he can keep a good frontal presence. So, honestly, I think that this is going to be a very even match, Vinny, coming from both sides. I do, too. I do, too, for sure. And um, I believe Mike, it was, he finished in second MVP um, in on the MVP charts this year, only to Istior, oh, okay. I believe. So you are correct about that. Yeah, he did did pop off once again. But, yeah, um, we should be getting started pretty soon in room. But I, I think real quick we have just time to go over predictions. I'm going to predict that Ellie wins this match by about 10 and sends us to a third match. I think it'll be very close, but I think Ellie's going to come out on top just barely with Mike MVPing with a score of, I'll go with 115. Ooh. That's what I'll go with. How, how about you, Will? Let's hear your um, predictions. Please. Honestly, I do want to see us go to a match. I do think that Ellie will take this one only because it seems that HK will be 4v5ing this match, uh, match two right here, because Fizzy Spaghetti is not in the room. So we're going to see how that fares off at home. But I do think Ellie will take this match, too, if they continue to 4v5. And I also think Mike will MVP in the room. I'll give him I'll give him 120. Let's see. I want to see all a big right. 120 out of him. But, yeah, all right. And uh, looks like we're about to get underway. That's correct. And, and yeah, there have <laughs> – this match was supposed to start um, way back, like, 30 minutes ago. But we had a little bit of trouble – Fizzy had to kind of get out of traffic and everything got stuck in it, so he's a little bit late coming home. But he should be getting home any time now, and after all these, after all this delay, we should be about ready to get started. Yes. And if it does get sent to match three, we will also have that for you, as um, both teams are able to play third match, if possible. But we got to get there first and see if that happens indeed, as the room is just now getting started. And we are going to Maple Treeway, I think that's what I seen as the first track. So, yeah. Let's see how this fares out. 4J starting in six ways. Yep, let's get her let's get her done. Good luck to both teams and we'll be Sherbet Land here. Um Penguin hit. Might want to see if four drop to get an eighth or if I were him is um Well this technically uh, is an Aether. Because uh, they yeah. are having Dino go backwards, so I don't. Is Bill Bill's That's able true. to pull in seven, right? If I'm not mistaken. Yeah. So, you yeah. can, I believe, yeah, pull Bill in seven in a nine player room. It's kind of weird, but he'll get shrooms. He'll just uh, shroom up here, and we'll pull a star in six. So um, he's probably just going to be holding this for a little while. Rock Dude dies though and takes out Ford you can in the see process. Deacon so. is already breaking away in first place, if you see that. So that means Ellie is occupying one, three, four right here. Soupy in second. 4J is fifth with a star, though. We're going to see which bagger is in 10 coming up here because it's looking like Hell's Kitchen is going to need it. And it is indeed Dino has stopped. So maybe he has it. Um, he hasn't moved. I think he pulled it already? He could have, yeah. I would I, I would imagine, yeah, as he is, yeah, I'm just not going for it. So I'd imagine that HK has shock now, and this is very good. Um, um, as Ford can afford to start at least for a little bit. I think Deacon uh, got blued or something because I saw him spin on the minimap and Pax is a little closer. Soupy's still in second. Uh, Hell's Kitchen occupying bottom three right now, currently. Mike pulling a indeed, TC slagging. Yeah. I like this. That's a smart play. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good, especially with um, Ford only start just to get him oh, a little further back. TC, they might be forced to call it here. Yep, better. he is. They should. Right, is, uh, he should be ready first here, which is a smart play. I would like to see him forward, and he is. I would have waited because he can break it under crack. But nice. He's yeah. Still, gets him anyway. uh, still none the worse for wear. This, uh, yeah, he'll just be in. He'll be in first. It should be a first, barring a blue or a last minute shot. But hopefully, um, Dino can just pull another one in. It is looking like it's looking like, four, four. it's looking like Landon's in ten right now. So it's going to be very unlikely that Dino gets another one. And see uh, the spots right now. It's looking like Ellie is occupying second. I think I saw Nubby in second. And yeah, might be a one Correct, three for yeah. kitchen. As you can see, Mike and uh, Wesley are also bottom two here, so Hell's Kitchen are occupying great spots here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this should be a very good first race for HK, but they played, I mean, they played this pretty well, and clutch shock from Dino as well um, to get Ford up there as he was holding that star. One, but three, Ford... blue on the line? Oh, it doesn't connect. Wait, did it connect? Oh, it connected. The blue, wait. It did, yeah. It did connect. That might be top two from Hell's Kitchen. That could also be huge, but everything, yeah, everything going their way, it seems, and... But it really started from the beginning of the race when um, 
when Forge is bagged for that starter because you it's so important to get a lower box on this track, especially since you can't catch up on it. And if you do get shock, it's pretty much like a win. So, yes. so good job on Forge for that part. And yeah, it's top two indeed. Top two seven, top two seven. coming from HK, which is a pretty strong start from him. Nice. So with all that, unfortunately we do not have Nubly's POV because he is not on a 30 second delay. Correct, yeah. We'll just be, it'll just be a Ford's POV that we will be rocking with for the time being. And I imagine AJK will probably just be going with Moonview, yep. Moonview Highway here, and LE probably going with a long track. BC3, it seems. Oh, wait, there's or eight players in the room. Dude. Eight players in the room. Oh. Yeah, uh, uh, I think it was LE. Someone in LE disconnected, if I'm not mistaken. Now, they did lose both their resets, though, so they cannot reset now, I believe. Uh, Or, or no, HK, I believe, is not calling a reset, so... Yeah, this race won't count. Looks like they may have called the reset for them, even okay. though Ellie is is out of reset. So, HK calls reset here in this race will not count. And yeah, we'll just see people sitting on the line. So, a little bit of a setback now, but hopefully we can have the room back up and going pretty soon. Is Ford's just going to run, <laughs> get a little bit of a practice run here. A little bit. It, and looks, it seems as it was dying on the so yeah, okay, yeah. All right. How many are, DC points are three uh, per race, isn't it? Yep. So would that be a... Uh, Top two, technically it would be a top two, bottom two. Coming from your face, you that person is. Yes. Correct. But, uh, yeah. So I think that makes score 31 to 22. If I'm not mistaken, coming in from the house kitchen, making the chicken early lead. I believe yes. I believe that is correct. Sounds about right <laughs> to me. I'm not amazing at, uh, quick math in my head, but <laughs> this thing <laughs> but um we can probably take just like a little bit of a break until we get about eight or so in room again and then come back to y'all once. Okay, cool. Room is about starting. Alright, we'll take a break and come back when the room's uh back up and they're almost ready to go guys.
Welcome back, guys, and the room is started back up, so we will be going into race two here. Um, still a 4v5, still only nine players. Um, as Fizzy <laughs> still has yet to return, but it'll probably be that way for most of the match, so unfortunately we will have to bear, to bear with this here. But HK leading 31 to 22 right now. Um, so a little bit of a lead, but not a big lead whatsoever and they're gonna be and le is gonna opt to go for maple tree way and kind of get that out of the way so that hk can't pick it later on perhaps when they're starting in top of this one three is rock dude loves maple tree they loves to run it up but it will be gv here so as benefits to hk is they still have maple to pick but also they get their track picks so um i would imagine two two would run and two would drop here ford would will probably be one of the drop people dropping as he'll be starting in uh sixth place oh uh, yeah and you're expecting a lot of people to be dropping for shrooms here we'll, uh, see what happens and he'll get lots of fifth he'll single green those and throws the it up, up. Oh, will he snipe out out oh, good snipe that's a great snipe coming in from forward that's gonna give him top two starting out really early triple greens uh see if he can hit it nubbly here also gotta watch out for snoopy as he was coming down from the top path but he's gonna have just a tad just a tad bit of a lead in first but nubbly Ooh, gets team. sniped with a single shroom he's not able to take the rock shortcut and that that's that's really bad not only he burned his shroom but also fell out of it from so yeah instead of instead of team cut in second would have had a big lead in first ends up getting um hit off but does pull triple shrooms in fifth so he should be able to take Rock here, lap two again. And we see the baggers right now. One of them did um, did go round. Another one's going for the strat right now. So at the moment, it is shockless. Um, so that definitely probably actually benefits HK as Ford. We see have a, has a shroom in third. In third um, place right Mike, now. though, is going to take the cut in first and is going to make it. Makes it so does every, so does Oh, top three makes the cut. So does, wow. And yeah, Ford, Ford here pulls another shroom in third, which is going to be very huge <laughs> as Nubly. Ford, Rock, and Mike all took cut like there. Failed. He's taking respawn on other POV. So top three is now gone here for um, Ellie. Oh, uh, Pal coming in. That's going to be kind of detrimental, but it shouldn't be too much of a problem because he should be able to pull another shroom here if he can. But uh, Top three should be on lock here for the most part. Doesn't get a shroom, but yeah, this lead is pretty sizable. I don't see this top three being uh, being taken out as, yeah, no one has. No one pulls no, shrooms. Rock, did not so push all three second. are going to yeah. go around. As we switch over to Nubby's Some... POV, he's going to go to Inter Cut. Him and Subi are both in. Is there going to be a shot coming in? There is. And this looks like it's a Ellie shot shocking out of HK, which will give Ellie top two for this match. Yeah, big big shock at the end um, from Yudo. Was able to, yeah, to get shot there and win them the race. As we saw Nubby building up and just take a respawn. They called him in perfectly. And yeah, it was just a free top two from there. And uh, these the shocks proving to be proving to be a difference maker after um, two races. If Snoopy knew that they had, I would have liked for him to wait to go in with um, Nubbly there. Because if you know the other bad guy is shocked, it is a lot better to wait until the other team goes in so they can't call you out for those exact situations right there, which uh, did not work out for HK. So they just end up getting top two off of it. Maybe if he would have slowed down right. and waited, he probably could have gotten in or they dodged with him at a better race. But it's okay. I guess there's a possibility he they could have spammed it perhaps or maybe uh, uh, Dino just didn't know that Yudo had it I think so. potentially. Because uh, I think uh, Yudo was the one who made Strat. So, I don't know. Yeah, who knows? Who knows? Might just be a little bit of there. miscommunications. Who knows? But yeah, you're very right about about if they had Snoopy for sure should have waited to get in. But it happens, and now. This is going to be pretty much tied, um, or very close, after two races, as we'll see MG coming out for HK, and Moonview Highway for LE. Interesting track pick, but I like it. I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of Moonview in top two. If you play it right, you can give yourselves a huge lead, uh, kind of after the hairpin, and uh, it no, if your team gets shock, or if they keep it shockless, and no lose, uh, it's kind of a... Kind of a GG there. It really is, gotta especially if you're starting right. like top two, four, fourth drafts. That's how the track really sells. But we are gonna go to Dry Dry Ruins, so that is the track that has been picked. DDR, a, a yep. fan favorite here. This is a, a track that gets picked almost everywhere. 
yeah, I lo I'm also a big fan of DDR. Um, we might see Ford try and drive up here again. He will, and that is a smart play as you really want Shrooms to take the Ultra Cut. And he does get a goal, and he gets just that. So a perfect item. He'll probably be holding this till the Ultra and just try not to get hit out. He's going to draft um, Wesley, though, and get into fifth with this right now. So just doesn't hit anything. He should be able to get into first. And he's going to do the wheelie uh, um, wall glitch. Takes it perfectly. And it's just... Still holding this in fifth right now. Golden Doubly in fifth here is going to get him straight to first place. So I'm liking this uh, hold of the golden here for forward. So it should get. Oh, Rockthu's also taking Ultra. We might see a top two here if he's also occupying his golden. Looks like he just took Triple Shroom Cut. And that is a top two for HK now. Mm hmm. It is indeed. Oh, but oh. Ellie right, actually right behind Ford now. So he's being pressured a little bit in first. Maybe he can get the screen to connect. He's having a bomb, bomb going for a snipe. Does, it not does not connect. It, it hits his teammate wow. though. But 4J oh. failed wall glitch, so I guess it kind of works out. But oh, he's getting ready, so it doesn't matter. Oh, he breaks it on the. He wow. breaks it. That was a pro break. <laughs> really. What a red break there. He really is playing. <laughs> I was a pro, pro um, chain of events there. So now just holding the screen first. Um, we'll see him. A little bit of the pillar, so he will not be able to take the sand hop. But Ford with a bomb in third with Ellie top two. But if Ford keeps his bomb, which he does, he might be able to make a play on top two up here. If he uh, throws us in the right spot, we'll see him line up for the snipe. Oh, but gets hold it. I, oh, voice of bomb. Uh, I wonder see, what he's going to uh, do with this. Shot coming out. Shot comes in. I wonder if it's uh, Ellie's kitchen shot. Uh, it does look like Rock Dude is coming up. Dodges in fifth place. I don't know, we need to see what he chained in order for it to be detrimental because Ellie's still holding top two here. Nubly is in a star in first place. Gonna... Oh, he's out now. And... He did get a ground star from his bagger in first. Yeah, it doesn't look like the top two is going to be broken up at all. It just wasn't enough for HK. That shock didn't do enough. I don't know. If they were holding it earlier, they... it, it, it might have been better equipped for them to use it a little bit earlier so they had more time to catch up that top two because when they used it there, um, top two was kind of broken and even Rock Dude dodging into what I think was a Mega didn't do enough. Snoopy, we did see come up a little bit late there, but he didn't gain any spots really from that shot. And it also TS forward in the sand at the wall glitch area too, so I'm not sure how long they were holding it, but if they had been only for a little while, it would have been better for them to use that just literally as we do see Ellie get top to uh, 6-7 here. Yes, I agree. I feel like they held that shock for a little too long in my opinion. I would like to have seen it used a little earlier, but honestly, it wasn't horrible. Honestly, I, if they would have used at the set, maybe before the Ultra, maybe we could have like, shocked into boxes, got a golden, and we can really get up there. Because uh, that shock didn't really do much for us. And uh, it got the Ellie uh, top 2 off of it, so... Honestly, I would like to see Elle's Kitchen uh, try to make more plays that uh, try to get them bigger races here. Because that's what they're going to need, especially in the 3v4 situation, Jimmy. Yeah, exactly. Um, they need to... Uh, they just need to get more more gains out of these shocks, and that's just really it. As as the, the story has been, shock um, really affected the outcome of the races. It has been shock, and... It, I, I feel like honestly the key for either team to win in this match is just to use shocks the right way and to get and, and to get more of a net gain than that out of them as as we go into race four here uh, still a little bit of a lead for LA but one big race from HK will turn the tables instantly and HK will get their track pick in Mushroom Gorge here another track in which shock is very important if whoever whoever gets it uh, that team is really highly likely to win the race but um yeah we shall see here see ford probably gonna drop a little bit gonna get a box in fifth here and we'll it's pull a bomb. a bomb besides the back and instantly getting two le members very smart player that's gonna put them out of the race for a minute mm -hmm. i will see he can if he can get shrooms here he oh, will get a tasty not ideal but might be able to pass might it too he does first try if uh, Deacon doesn't have anything there. there, he might be. Oh no, he just has a star grid. So he's gonna just keep. He's gonna be able to stay in the race over that. 4J pulling a golden. Gonna be golden. A bomb! Oh! Oh, he's off the wow. gap though, because of that bomb. That bomb, I think, altered his uh, his line alignment for that gap and caused him to, to, to fail it there. Yeah. Yeah. And he's in 
way back here in it's now. Uh, just gonna be trying to scramble to get back up there. We Nubbly's see Nubbly in still first, in first place, green. starting to break away, holding a green show right now. Doesn't really have any threats. Looks like he's just gonna get a free run for now. Uh, I think Robinson Landon might be in second. Is Dino in ten or Lynn in ten? I, only I, see am, one. I see one bagger sitting, and the other one is coming. Yeah. I know Landon is the one driving right now. Pal coming out. I don't know why we use the pal so early. If that's a HK pal, but. Okay, Dino has shock. He's going forwards now, so Dino, Dino currently uh, pulling the shock, looks like. Yep. So, um, they might, they'll probably opt to just TS Nubbly in either the cave or... If, shot okay, coming out early, coming first set. 4J, Four dodges. solo dodger, pull, change triple reds, you don't want to see that. He, needs, he Mike, needs shrooms here. He needs a shroom in order to get a good two. raise. He doesn't. He gets a single red. That's not going to be enough. It looks like Ellie probably going to get top two once again, barring a late blue maybe from HK. That's really their only win condition this one. He does pull a shroom now, but Shrooming I think third. it's going to be too late. It's not going to do Unless much. Unless he goes for like a world record gap, I don't think he will beat Deacon here. And no, Ellie getting a top two. Rock two fishing in fourth? Yeah. I believe so, yeah. And we see Wesley finishing back there. But another good race from LE, even though they did not have shock. Well, I guess that contradicts my point, my point of earlier when the team that gives shock energy usually wins the race. But we looks like I jinxed it, and we do not see that here as LE did win that race. But it, but but they once again played that race super well. That bomb on the gap for Ford lap one was a huge bomb from them. I assume it was their bomb um, that caused him to fail the gap, and then Nubly getting into first and running it up and. Did not get TS'd and just kept first the rest of the way. It's a good play. He plays once again. And I figured that star dodge from Ford would be enough to get him up there, but it just wasn't. As his chains were not very good, triple reds and then a single red. He, when he did pull the stream, it was just too late for it to do anything. Yes, and as we can see, it looks like Ellie is going to take a not commanding lead here. Because uh, if we're adding up. Fizzy's points, they do. Oh, they're at 102. It is 124 to 102, is the score currently. So it's like a 20 point lead coming in from Ali. 3v4. Honestly, if I'm HK in this situation, uh, the momentum is obviously shifted in Ali's direction. Honestly, I, I think they need to calm down. We had a couple bad. We have a couple bad races, and just to come back at it strong next one. Honestly, we're pulling. They're, they're pulling shocks, but they aren't getting the races that they need with the shocks. So. I think that they need to focus on trying to uh, utilize better shocks here if they want to have a chance of uh, staying in this. Yeah, I'd agree 100%. HK just needs to kind of reset mentally here and tell themselves we're still in this, we can win this. They don't have that big of a lead, still a lot of time to go and just keep going. Um, but it's going to have to be done here on Moonview Highway C4 getting really bumped at the start and is going to be back in the pack. Uh, at least I'm being avoids the cars. Uh, might back the fib. Yeah, he will back the tight. Hits a tight mana though, um, and the fib does not connect, so he's not in a good spot. Nubly still Nubly's holding. still holding first down place. Down Very dominant in the front. Snooping in second place, behind him. Opting to back the boost panel doesn't hit. Hell's Kitchen occupying spots two, four, five right now. So, this is a yeah. very good position if you are a leader. His front running on this track is very detrimental. Landing gone in 10 as well, too. So they probably should pull shock here. Um, there's everything coming up. Oh, Ellie. oh the Ford, Ford tricks, into the, tricks bomb into the bomb. That's hard. And then he gets squished by the truck. <laughs> Ford, what are you doing? Oh, Wait, dude. but Mike. Oh, what? Oh, stars <laughs> didn't buy pick up his own ground star. And Rock did run into the bomb. <laughs> <car>. <laughs> what, what is, is going, going on? on right now? Okay. What a sequence. What? What? That. I don't even know. Nubly getting moved in first moved in right first now. Place. Doesn't matter. Wesley is still in second, so they're still going to hold top two. Goes wide because of the yellow car. So that puts Snoopy in second place. What is going wow. on in this race? Look at this pack. It is just I don't so even split. know. <laughs> it's <laughs> split. It is indeed. And that's really bad for HK as Ellie is holding the top two at the moment. I think, yeah, there's only one at HK up there. This pal's going to be -Pal really bad for Nubly, though. It's still fine because they're going to hold top two. Snoopy still third. Uh, H HK right behind him. And Snoopy pulls a, a TC in third. That is the worst case scenario. You do not want to see that. They're going to uh, easily avoid these cars. Bomb car coming. Gets past it. And it's looking like a free top two right now. Top two 
four? Yeah, I, yeah, this is like top two four from uh from LE here. Yeah. Wait, um, that might be a top four. Here. Uh, my oh, it might might uh, have been a top, be top four. <laughs> wow. But what a sequence! To, what, what a, a sequence of events that lap two was. That was insane. Like we saw, like everyone dying there, mostly HK. Uh, they just kept hitting everything. But we oh. we switched to POV just to tally, it, so we didn't really see the whole the whole thing transpire. All we saw was him tricking right into the bomb car and then getting hit by the truck because he couldn't move out of the way in time, and then rocking. <laughs> Rock running right to the then. bomb car, and then Deacon and then <laughs> dropping a star, star. starring him. It was just it was a complete chaos it was it was like a circus Indeed, going on four. Four, but somehow wow. it works out for ellie and they get top four off that race which is really impressive so salute ellie salute. is owning this match right now not really much else to say they're completely dominating now they're really starting to break away here that was that was really really bad for hk i mean you i mean you can't help but feel like you horribly misplayed that race and no one's no one's fault but yourselves for them getting top four there's the pack for the most part until that happened was pretty close they could have definitely hit Ellie out and at least kept up with them but after that beginning a lap two there was no catching up for them as the pack was very very split and now it's just HK is gonna really need some big winning races now if they want to come back as we enter the second part of the war going into race six here yeah HK uh, down 40 if, uh, no math no I do not know math they are down 49 <laughs> there we go so honestly, yep. <laughs> they're not completely out of it yet. There's still potential to come back, and honestly, we're the track pick won't help though. It's not. This we. is a great track pick for sure. Top spots. So we'll see. Oh, second burns out. That's a. Uh, oh. I guess I can help I... out a little bit. Okay, no, it gets the back. Both HK members getting hit there. Then play Mike there to man up two HK members there, but your second burning out is not ideal whatsoever. That. Couldn't ask for much. And Mike dies and Ford hits the fib on the landing there. Uh, gonna not change this room, but will not get a box. As 2LE is back here, though. So, uh, spot's a little mixed. Snoopy with the TC, uh, looking like he's gonna have to eat this. Yeah, not gonna be able to pass four in time from there. 4J forces him back because of Red Show. Is, uh, Rock Dude is in second, gets back, so LE will be taking top two going to this race. Mm -hmm. Let's see how Ford can contest Wesley here. Oh, goes through oh. the fin. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, right through <laughs> right it. Right through it. He was <laughs> And the green did not connect either, so. What oh, tricks and I could not hit. Almost connects close. Nana doesn't work there. Four gonna shroom up and still gonna be in third Ford. to pull yet another shroom. <laughs> Hack and shrooms. Gets Nana though, unfortunately. Goes through another banana. Hits a wall. You do not want to be doing that. Now giving up top uh, three yeah. for Ellie. Yeah, definitely. We'll we, I don't know what Snoopy has. Although one oh, Ellie did die there. To Wait, how? Nubby's off in first. Oh, two of them die. So it's 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 now going to be one three for Snoopy activating a him. mega on Mike. Will he get him? He doesn't connect, but that is Snoopy is occupying first place. I wonder what happened to Nubby for him. maybe the see how happened. Oh, but Snoopy gets righted out of first, so Mike now takes back first place. This is a back and forth race coming out. Four J will be holding second here. Rock dude coming. Mike. Oh, shooting up. Yeah, one. They're top two now? I don't know. <laughs> For Ali, Nubby's is... holding up. Actually, he's going to be in second now. All now, Nubby is streaming back up to second. This is... Oh, but he gets sniped by Mike, his own teammate. Oh, the team kill there. Very, very bad. Nubby was really the only front punch, but he immediately got hit up by his own teammate. That's not what you want to be doing now, there. Now, HK, Let's great see. spots here. One, one, three, one, three, four coming up from HK. If they play this right, they can get a really good race and start to get back in it, but they just cannot die here. You gotta hold these top spots and pray there's no blue or shock. Uh, oh, triple red. Oh, hits the, the fire. fire. You do not want to do that, especially oh. in your last position. Nubby has a power in fifth. They're probably gonna T power in the last turn, I would expect. Yep, here goes Pals yep. coming out. And I don't know if that it really does much, not no. use it too early. Wait, Rock Dude gets him top two. Blue coming out online. Super gets reddit. Oh, they're getting top two. Wow. Blue coming Apple out and then Snoopy gets reddit. For the line. So Ellie Jeez. gets top two off of that race. Wow. They end up winning it again when it looks like it was going to be HK's race to get back in it. They just, before it makes a horrible misplay by hitting the fire with those triple reds he had, he could have done major damage with them. 
And the pal looks like actually they have t taken out Rock Dude. I thought it was used literally just by looking at the mini map, but it might have done a significant damage in the end. And then we saw that blue just at the end, just absolutely killed. Or actually, oh, Soupy gets Soupy second. got second still. Wow. So okay, it's so one, it's three, five. one three five, which is still like a very good race for Ellie, but not yeah. as bad as it could have been. It's just what I'm, what I'm seeing, Vinny. It's just a lot of mistakes coming out from both teams, like. Forward running to the fire, you're seeing like on um, we're going out on um MH even like when that lap two, like both teams are just running to cars. Like you, these are when you're in a finals match, this is not what you're expecting to see. You know, this is like you made Correct. it here. You're supposed to be the best of the best. Like these small mistakes are obviously gonna cost you. So like to having two pembers get off after the pal, like so when you're LE, like when you're in like top two, like it's just I don't know. It's these small mistakes that are gonna cost these uh these points, and that's gonna obviously make you lose the, the finals you, you fought so hard to get here you know so you have to give it all correct you give it your own. that is right that is ex exactly right and it just seems like the mistakes are are just a little more costly on on a hk's end we do we we, we, we have seen ellie's ellie's ellie make a fair their fair share of mistakes but it's just been more costly on hk's side it seems especially towards the end of the races we're seeing these misplays too and it's just been and that's just been HK's downfall really this match. So if they can clean it up a little bit, I feel like they might still have a chance to come back. Is there still there's still time, but, but they're running out of time now. So they need to do something now. It's, it's we see uh, it's gonna be RBC here, and Snoopy to get a draft, but it's still gonna be top two at the moment for Ellie. Uh, Nano Slam Temp does not work for it. Item list. Oh, Nubby hits him out of second. Uh, Snoopy's still up there though. He had his own teammate, I believe. They're rocking a mega right now. Uh, it's just gonna be zooming through the pack. <laughs> the triple reds for Ford. Probably have swapped to back these. Yep, and we'll hit him. Ooh, but he hits a wall though. Hits a wall though, yeah. unfortunately. Switch over to Nubby's POV. Subi is occupying first slicer. Yeah. So right now it's uh, L HK is in a decent spot. Nubby just holding this red right now. Um, uh, we'll see what he has to do with this. Pal's gonna be coming in a second. Gonna have to throw this up. It's gonna fall off the track, but bomb um, attempt. Oh, close! Not Very hit. close. Does not hit though. Looks like we are seeing two, three coming out from Ellie. I wonder if they can do a little draft party here. No. Oh, blue coming out from Ellie. I haven't seen a many. We haven't seen many blue shells come out from uh, both these teams. Looks like Subi dodges in the first. Has shrooms in first place. Wow. That is. This huge. is really good then for him. That is really he, good, but he, this pack is not good at all, which means. If he's not going to keep... Oh, so, okay. So, he only had one shroom. So, he's going to now start backing them, which he needs to do to make sure that the, this gap size gets closed. Because Hellkitten does... They do need big races here. As we switch over to four J's POV, he is, wow, getting random green in last. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunate for him. But he pulls a gold in. He's trying to come back up. But he is kind of just gone. Switch back to Nobi's POV. He's still in second right now. Uh, I don't think Snoopy... Is just gonna lose this. Like the blue is really the only way if they get another one. Landon sitting on the rail, which tells me that he's holding sh uh, shock at the moment. Yes. I want to say. So uh, Ellie currently holding shock. They might be able to some like Snoopy. Although I don't think they will. Uh, Snoopy is just too far gone, and Nubly is not pulling shrooms at all. So nothing much he can do. But uh, HK needs to do their best to try Ooh, and get the result. Although out. we do see a blue coming in. Well, he it combos with the red, red combo. and he combos with the red, so Ellie will take first. Ellie's pulling two blues in this RBC race. I already know that has to be kind of tilting for HK. Soupy. This Very is another POV. So. 4J getting TC'd. Oh, you do not want to see that. Then red combo. Soupy is in six. This is looking like a top two right now. As we switch back to we Nubby. Might, might see Shock late here, although it's probably, they, they might, probably, they might opt to so. hold. They are really good spots. They'll be yeah, trying to play it safe, slowing down. <laughs> and it's looking like, yes, yeah, the top two for LE once again. again. Top two, four. They call shock very late, but I don't know if it does anything. Uh, yeah. That's just another good race for LE. Uh, un very unfortunate for Snoopy. I mean, he has to be punching it right now after those two blues. I mean, he was just gone in first, and no one was getting him out of there, but just those two blues were very unfortunate. And if you're HK, there's really nothing you could do there, except I would have wanted to see more of them up at the front with Nut with Snoopy because he really didn't have any support up there at the front. It was just Nubly and then uh Mike until he got hit out, but then it was just um Wesley. 
So he really didn't have any support up there, and that's, that's not that's not a recipe for success, especially on RBC. You're not going to win very many races, even if even if you are first. You need to you need to be up there with him. You need the support, and HK is not doing that great of a job of doing that. Yeah, so and especially in a three v four situation when you, Ellie has more players, which means that they have a higher chance of pulling the blue shell, obviously. And especially in a race where Soupy's the only one up there and top three are gone, and then the other two players are back there just chaining boxes in mid spots trying to get blue. Yeah, it's just not gonna mm -hmm. work out. You just need to see more frontal passes from HK, which we're not getting. Snoopy doing a great job staying up there by himself, but we if right. if all three uh, runners from HK aren't uh, staying up there, just gonna just keep consistently getting losing races. Like I don't know. Right. This is why I think uh, their main reason why they're down so much now is because just the lack of frontal presence coming out from them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no doubt about it. And also them missing Fizzy, their fourth runner is really hurting them as well as they are already a disadvantage. There are an automatic disadvantage just by not having four runners. So that's also been bad. I mean, most, yeah, you really, it's hard, very hard to win a war of 4v5 when you're on the wrong side of it. So they, they don't really have that working for them just because of unfortunate circumstances. But you got to keep going. You, I mean, you got to see what you can do with the last uh, six, with these last four races or five races, my bad. I I can't do math today, but uh, <laughs> it's all good. we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. T. Four J. I'm gonna go for Bill. Will he get here. it? No, he doesn't. He's gonna try again in eighth place, and he does not get the bill. So we're gonna switch over to Nobby's POV, and oh, he gets killed. Starting in first place. So both of our POVs is in the back right now, but uh, it's yeah. looking like Ellie might be in first place, if I'm not mistaken. I can't. I can't really tell from the main map right now. Oh yeah, uh, Ellie are top two right now. Be. They are. Okay. So yeah. Um, and then oh wow, top three now. just just like that. Both <laughs> HK members getting killed, and that is just going to be a top three break coming in from Ellie. This is just nothing you do not want to see if you're HK. You just have to get up there. He gets green though, random green, but does have a stream to recover, so it's really not going to do much. It's going to break this red uh ample triple red so he's gonna be safe and it's just looking like top three breaking away um a pal's not really gonna change much but hk is starting to come back it's starting to catch up just a little bit we saw ford using his star but it's still top three and this is still worst case scenario for hk although someone fa failed the uh the um the cut i think it was nubbly who failed streamless there and that allows ford to get into third here and break up the top three a little bit but it's still a top two for LE, and they're still in really good spots right now. They're going to need more than HK is going to need more. They're going to need some blues, and they're going to need a shock if uh, one doesn't have. And I am back, and we are seeing Nubly in seventh now. And the shot coming in looks like it's an LE shock. Deacon dodges up in the bullet bill, and LE now are occupying top three once again. This is just something that we need. Ford has to go for a play here. Blue coming out, and he doesn't throw it far enough. Which means that Ellie will get a top three this race. And I don't want to say it yet, but it's looking like this match is starting to become over. Yeah. I'd say it's we're getting close to it. We're getting close to the uh to Ellie putting the final name on HK's coffin for this match, and it's looking like we'll likely have a third match. So more entertaining for the viewers, hopefully. This is what we wanna see. We wanna see a close, we wanna see it go to three matches. We don't wanna see a team blow out. A team two nothing, especially by a large margin. Yes, I want this to be fun and close, and looking like so we'll have here is yeah, Ellie's just breaking away. They're getting consistently getting top twos and top threes. We see this top three five here. Uh, yeah, it's just but Ellie to their credit has played extremely well. They are a lot better phenomenal. than match one. They are playing very phenomenal. Uh, well, these later races, <laughs> even their mistakes haven't been as costly as HK's. But uh, they are definitely playing a lot better in the 3v4 scenario. That top two backing, uh, when they backed uh, Rock Dude and Supi on um, lap one, that was just basically guaranteed the race right there. Because both players were killed. Nubby had triple reds in third and triple shrooms as a shame. That's just basically a guaranteed free race right there for them. So I like uh, what they're doing right now. They're uh, doing really good plays, and it's working out for them. Yep, definitely. Um... And we just want to see him keep this momentum going. We want to see him put, uh, keep their foot on the gas. Um, 
as we don't want to see him like relinquish any of this momentum and allow HK to like they have a sense of like or a chance of winning at least the third match. You know, even though you're up by a lot and even though it's pretty much over, you still want to keep that that bulldog mentality and that killer instinct and to not let them to not let your opponents back in for a third match because if HK strings together a couple of really good races here at the end and even makes it close, uh, that's not that's not good for LE, especially going into match three. You know, so you definitely want to keep these winning races going and keep playing. Honestly, just keep playing like they're down. I mean, that's just so key in this it, 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 in these finals. So uh, I, I would like them to keep it going here. Um, and they will get their track pick once again. It'll be Parkway here. TKJP, uh, 4J opting Shroom up to first. Interesting play. I like it, though. Very aggressive. And it's Zupi opting and uses Mega instantly, too. Looks like Els Kitchen is trying to change their approach and uh, get to the front immediately. Something that they haven't been doing. Wesley ends up getting the better of that exchange, though, and he's going to bully his way back into first. Mike does pull a TC, though, but he might be able to pass to Snoopy, and he does. And Snoopy gets nanoed and forward, it gets a little bit of collateral damage there. And they're still just top two at the moment, but Ford just got to try to avoid Mike's backspam and maybe uh, Wesley's backspam. I would like to see some double backspam here from Elliot, maybe at a couple of turns above. I don't know if you're going to do it here, obviously, but... Uh, these these hits just these just aren't connecting from Mike here. Ford's just avoiding them. Good for him. And um w hope holding the star in fourth. Here. Hopefully, um we don't know what Bagger's intent right now, but it could be Oh, a bag bomb. Honestly, he could have reacted to that. And yep, it is gonna be a top two shot coming in from Ellie, which just is gonna break them away and have them get about a break in top two now. Which is a really dense for metal for uh HK. Because now they have to claw their way back into the fight. And it looks like Landon is still 10 as well. Which is not good at all. But Ford is holding a Mega in fourth. So maybe uh, we will see like a last set chain coming out from him. He can take the shortcut. Because honestly, banking on another shock. You would you need a, a cannon shock here to come back. And he does opt to chain it to get up there. He's going to take the grass cut. And he might be able to Mega Mike here. Now he takes it a little too wide. He doesn't Mega him unfortunately. But he is in third. If Dino can pull a clutch niner here, this will save the race. But I doubt it. We'll see, though. Oh, Nubby holding blue in seven. So this yeah, is basically... this is looking like going to be a good race for Ellie, especially with the blue holding with laning on in 10. Should be able to pull another one. And we will see another shot coming in here in just a second. It looks like that was uh... a house Kitchen shot because Landon was just off. I think that was the HA shot. Ooh. Dino pull a nine question mark? Question yes. mark. Both of our uh, POVs Ooh. are in the back, but I'm pretty sure that was a HK shock and they might be two three. Yeah, Rock Dude isn't they are in fact L is occupying two three four J holding pal, which means that they have good items in up there. Dino saving the race for HK. It was looking like it was gonna be all elite, but wait a second as it's all gonna come down to what four chains let's say triple shrooms. Triple shrooms? But two L E dodge are uh, died there, died there, yeah. And uh, I think I think L HK got two three five really really it's good like, there. I don't, I'm gonna say really good. It's looking like a two three five coming out from HK. Okay. So I'm pretty sure nothing right, yeah. online, but uh, it's still better than what they have been getting. So yeah. It was a lot better than what they were going to get there because LE had all the all the things or all the tools are to win that race. Blue hold lane and gone in ten should have pulled the other one, but uh, Dino with his luck, was able to save it for 8k there for a little bit. Uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, and they are going to get 235, yes, coming out from HK, which is not winning, I'm pretty sure. Just because they're messing with the same player. Maybe it is. I'm not 100% sure, though. Yeah, I'm not... I, I, I'm not with, with like, 9-player point different, 9-player room point differentials for 235, but I think you might be right there. But nonetheless, it's not really going to move the needle at at all for HK. They need bigger races. They, they, they really need bigger, like, like they need like top two or really even a top three, which in, which for them would be a perfect race, like a top three, eight. But um, you know, it's better than what they have been getting. The races that they have been getting, lately. so maybe it is a step in the right direction for HK. I'd like to see him get their traffic here, as it seems like they haven't gotten a traffic in forever. So maybe that could give him a little bit of a morale boost as well. We shall see here. Hopefully, because they are definitely going to need a morale boost. Hopefully, Fizzy will be able to make an appearance this next match, because they will need it, because 3v4 is not working out for them at all. 
They're just not getting the races they need off of it. Yeah, and you hate to see it in the finals as well. You don't want to see up up four v five. You want to see it. You you want to see a nice five v five, but being even on all playing fields. It's just not fun, you know. When you're missing a runner and you know you can't do anything about it, you know. So hopefully we will be graced with Fizzy's presence in match thir in match three, because well, first of all, HK just needs five players in general, you know. It'd be nice for them to get an extra runner, and Fizzy can be a nice little playmaker when he is when he's playing there. So we'll see, but uh, yeah, BC3 here, and see Deacon just getting into first here, trying this Nana, might block the cut here, uh, I think he did, <laughs> uh, this green attempt coming out will not connect, but we do see a couple of cut takers here, um, or one failed, so not sure, ooh, a nice red from Ford, Gets was able to red uh, Deacon there, it was Rock taking cut, so it'll be top two for HK. A good start for them. Rock could have more shrooms, um, so he could take cut again or two laps. His back rim will not connect on Mike. Ellie is uh, is right behind him. They're in three four at the moment. Backing battle pretty even at the moment. So uh, I'm telling really who's gonna pull Shocker if anyone has at the moment. One of the battles just fell off of Bill, I believe, too. So one of them's gone to ten now. Yes, I'm gonna see Ford block the cut. Rock dude takes it and then he blocks afterward. That is a huge play coming up from HK. Unfortunately, it might have not been blocked as someone has taken ultra. It's either they take ultra or shrimp, but I wasn't really paying attention. But I'm gonna assume that that he's cut ultra. was not blocked. It wasn't blocked. Okay, <laughs> that, never mind then. Yeah, that cut was definitely takeable. Mike took cut in second there with the shroom. This is so fine. This is not the worst case scenario. Yeah, that cut is 100% takeable. As we have. 1-3 coming up from HK, and this pack is once again <laughs> just a madness. It's just, it's, <laughs> I don't, I don't really know what this to say. Textbook BC3 race cuts. I, I mean, the pack's 100% split. You don't know who's where, but yet you can still find a way to win the race. And now Ford pulls the blue, so Rock Floating should blue. keep first. I think he goes, I think he take, yeah, I, I believe he took cut again, and that's him. Yeah, he's way gone in first. Oh, shot comes shot. out. He has him forward. I think he was off there anyway, but he is off. He's going for Shroomless. Let's go for it. Make... play? No. Aw, rip. Uh, I, like, I like the aggressiveness, though. You got I nothing do. to lose. You literally have nothing gonna to lose go this match. Again. Now he makes it. And he it. makes it this time. <laughs> Second time One is One for five from HK. Or two for five, actually, as uh, Rock Dude is down second. <laughs> Yeah, this bomb is going to be thrown away here for uh, uh, four clips the wall. And it's going to lose a spot to Deacon as well. Shot coming in on the line, but it's not going to matter, I don't think. Is uh, Yeah, this war is pretty much meaningless at this point. Yeah, it's looking <laughs> like it's over. Uh, they're down over 100. Uh, two races left. This is not looking likely. <laughs> Bless you. Yeah. <laughs> correct. You are correct about that. Um, yeah, Rock did get second there. I'm not sure. I thought that I I thought he took cut in first lap three. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I was wrong. I thought I thought that was him with the break, but I was mistaken oh, there. Guess not. But yeah, um, we will get you guys ready for match three pretty soon. Once this wraps up, stick around. You don't want to miss it. This one will be for all the marbles. Who's who is going to be crowned Division 6 champions? Will it be Hell's Kitchen or will it be Luminescence? We will find out in match 3. DK Mountain is Ford's going to be going for DKM here. MC3 will be coming out for LE. Kind of like this DKM pick here from HK. I'm not sure how good they are at it necessarily, but if they are good at it, why not get some extra practice and is maybe you could pick this again in match three if you're in top spots is especially in lower divs uh i don't think like too many players are very comfortable with dkm as it is a very tech heavy track and not a lot of people take the time to really teach you and get it down to the and, and get it really down so they're really good at it but if but so that's why if a team is really good at it it's it, it could be such a big advantage you can abuse that track mightily Maybe that's the case with HK here. And we're going we Raceway. Race nice. I like the tracks coming out now. This is, uh, let's just have a little bit of fun. 
traffic coming out here. Yes, sir. Let's see what Ford gets here. Triple reds. Looks like Snoopy is going to not red Mike here. Two, three, four for HK. Um, with Ford pulling a single green. Let's see if he can. See if anyone takes by here. He can red. Might be able to red up. Uh, it's like, yeah, Wesley here. Red. Red, yeah, he's not really had much luck with these reds connecting here. He's going to now pull triple shrooms. And we'll get the draft off a of nubbly here and take cut. Man, Rock occupying first at the moment. Green step attempt is not going to hit. And <laughs> 4J nice. shrooming around, having a little bit of fun. <laughs> it's ready. Size the drop here. I like it. Nubbly I like it. Is holding a star in fifth. I'm not sure if he's. I'm just gonna hold hold this to lap three or three. Probably is. Wonder it, baggers uh, are going forward, which means that uh, one of them do have. I'm mean, gonna guess it's Ellie, ooh. as how Nubly has been holding the star for a while. Yeah. Four J uh, also holding a star. Setter. You might see a first setter. Let's see. If I'm Ellie, I'm I'm holding this until at least second set. After the pipes. I, I I would agree. Second or third set. Maybe yeah. kind of try to be a little unpredictable with it so Ford doesn't predict. Yeah. Oh, shot comes out. coming in there. He, he first frame, frames that. Uh, and this will get him into second. second Nubbly. Nubbly yes, he got to start too. So we'll see him in first. Uh, <sighs> this pal is going to be coming in. I assume Ford. an elite pal. Oh. Kills him. Kills, Kills him Ford. Horribly. Takes him into the grass. His own Nana hits him. That's just salt to the wound right there. Hey, Rock do pull the Mega. So it looks like Else Kitchen is going to get 2 3. If he makes him here, I will laugh. Okay, he doesn't. He doesn't. 2 to 4, maybe? Nice. 2 to 4. That's a winning race coming in from HK. Wow. Good one. Good race for HK. Yeah. Hopefully they can end up on a high note here. You know, that's all, that's all they can really ask for with these last couple is to end off on a good good one. And um, it was a good prediction by Ford as we did see him dodge that star in first frame. Wasn't enough to get Nubbly out of first, but you will gladly take the two, three, four off of that rather than uh, a big race for Ellie. Whereas if you didn't predict it, so yeah, yes. you have two, three, four. Two, three, four out. Nice. Is that a Nubbly on a one nineteen after eleven? Nice. That's very impressive performance coming off him. He's come off huge this match. I, I want to see He's the one thirty. I do want to see one thirty. We we did predict uh, Mike would be the, the the top scorer, but Nubbly is proving himself different. That uh, he is a threat to be reckoned with as we can see definitely and we knew he had this potential coming in he has he's also been one of the players that has improved a lot especially over those past uh, year not even just his gsc seasons but lately he has been on the rise as far as skill level goes he has been so uh, i know he's he definitely emerald has. class s if I'm, if I'm not mistaken this season recently so showing that he has been improving a lot recently so, I mean, it makes sense why he is performing on this match. Indeed. Indeed. Pull up coming through when Ellie needs it the most. That's really all you can ask for is is to perform. Absolutely. And he is a big, proving that he is a big time player. And um, we'll see if he can uh, continue that into match three. And we'll see if Mike can, if Mike steps it up a little bit too. Because they could have a potential double threat on Ellie with with the dynamic duo of Nubbly and Mike up there. Could be a deadly combo. We shall see, though. This will be last race of the Warren. It will be Coconut Mall coming in here. Yeah, Single red for Ford here in second. Uh, can't really do much with this as both well. Snoopy and Rock are in front of him right now. Nice little low trick there. Gets bumped a little bit by Landon. Who just comes out from the heavens <laughs> and, and hk i keep finding good spots right now and uh look, looks like deacon just goes up to first place which is uh not the best maybe if they can get him out here this would be huge as they would be top three but uh let's see as long as he can hold his spot here everything is fine for ellie <laughs> yeah uh his back fam not gonna connect there a good evasion by by um soupy four and just holding this room in fourth at the moment uh, he'll probably just have to take cut. He could get close to Deacon, though, with this cut if he takes it. Takes a good one, and maybe perhaps can try to get another item at one of the sets up here to hit him out. But yeah. right now, Deacon just trying to trap the rails before it takes the one that he is not on. 
wisely. Uh, Nubbly coming up here in second, and it's now two for LE again. And some nice little infi trick from Ford. Avoids that really tight banana. <laughs> really tight banana. Maybe <laughs> plays a little too tight there, perhaps. Misses the box, though, because due to a high trick, that's not ideal. Um, and it's going to get redded out by Wesley. But he hits the car, though, I think, or did he get starred? Um, I am not 100% certain. And Leia just stopped trolling a little bit. That was fun. <laughs> do we do a little bit of trolling here? We do do a little bit of trolling. Oh, Bill coming in at 7. Oh, no. Ending 4J's race. Unfortunate. <laughs> From Super. <laughs> Dirty Bill there. Dirty Bill indeed. And Nubbly. Ooh, there's a sign there, buddy. But it doesn't matter because now he's going to red them. And he's going to get back to 2nd. Wow. What is going on? Wow. When it's going bad, it's going bad. For HK there. It it's, really that's is. Just, that's just... The epitome of this war for them. Uh, it's gonna break this red. It should be a top two here from Ellie. Nubbly going for a trick Doesn't site throws it way too early. And shot comes wait, no, Nubbly we'll... needs to get second in 130. No, oh, Snoopy gets the car. Oh, Snoopy gets the car. <laughs> the, actually get the 130. For the 130, here. go <laughs> Navy. I think, I, think he, I think he got second. Maybe it was oh. very, very close. Everyone else reset for but. Wow, Snoopy! Snoopy that's Snoopy a car, buddy. You can have this one he literally, no, <laughs> literally gave it to him. You can have it. That is very. That, that's a, that is a very funny way to end this race. And yes, he, he does, does get the one thirty. Get the 130. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Le ends with like a top three and and an emphatic end for Le, but they deserve this win. They played amazing. Oh, 100%. They played out of their minds, and and yeah, you just want to keep this. Momentum going. Actually, wait, is it higher than a uh, one thirty? Because that was race twelve, right? It is higher because they are uh, reset yeah. after race one, so it's actually a one thirty eight coming in for Nobly. Wow. True, true. One thirty eight in the I eleven player room. That was 11... so long ago. That reset. Yeah, I don't even know. I completely <laughs> forgot about it too. But a one thirty eight in the eleven player room is really impressive, Vinny. You know what that means? It means that he's gotten first so many times because uh, the point distributions in the eleven and uh, nine player rooms are like, really bad. So like to get a 138 mm -hmm. means you have to have gotten first majority of the races. I would have to say at least like 60% of them of the races you probably got first, and if not, he got like a top three spot every other time, which is really impressive. Pretty much every yeah, pretty much every time you get at least a top five spot. But perhaps this is his best performance of his MK Week career, given the circumstances. It's finals, your team's got its back against the wall. If you don't win, it's over. And Nubbly comes in and drops a fat 138. Uh, they won. The final was one. Uh, Ellie did win by 128. Rock Dude MVP for HK a score of 80. Um, our POV Ford scored 73. And and we will see. Uh, hopefully a mastery coming in. And this um, is for the final results. We have Ellie winning by a margin of 114. First match at 389, 275. So honestly, this is not the greatest start for HK, but honestly, this is not over for them. Hopefully, they can get five players in this next match. If not, this it might be a repeat of this match. But uh, yeah, we do not want to see another blow up going to the finals. And uh, yeah, but um, they're just playing this race off for fun. And uh, I know we're gonna take a break here, Vinny, to the next match. Yep, and we will get back to you guys pretty soon. Stay tuned, y'all. Stay tuned. We'll be back when uh, the match three is about to begin.
Welcome back, everyone. And match three between Luminescence and Hell's Kitchen is just now getting underway. We will be using the use POV for this match. We do not have the graphic for that. Apologies, but just know it is his POV. It is not Nubly's POV. Ford, uh, we do not have his POV anymore. He had his stream, so all uh, so the only POV we're going to have is the use. Um, and should be a, it, it should be lit. Should be fun match. Everything's on the line here for bragging rights and the banner um, in Division 6. And let's, let's get to it. Should be good. Should be Should fun. Be and it will be starting out with MT. Maple Tree Way. All right. We will have a 5v5 now. Stakes are even. And yeah. Let's see how this yep. uh, fares up now. There should be no more excuses. I want to see a nice, clean, fair fight. And uh, hopefully, we can get a really close match. That's right. Fizzy is back. So. Other than that, no lineup changes, I don't believe. It's just busy subbing in for her, so. Yep, 5v5 now. Yusk is currently in 6th, and we'll pull triple shrooms for here, and he'll probably just either off to change or maybe hold them for the cut lap too, as Pack is close. We see Deacon just trying to stay. This is going to hit uh, Fizzy, though, out, out of there, I believe. So now it's going to be 2, 3, 4, 5 for Ellie, with Rock Dude being the only, only one up there for HK. It's up to him to hold this top spot. Uh, well, Ford is making his way up there too now, so he's getting a little bit of help, and uh, that's what we want to see. Nubly gets hit out uh, of there, so now Yusuke will have his Truman in fourth right now, and it'll be 2-3 for HK with Mike barely in first right now. Yes, it should be a top two after Nub uh, Goose takes a cut here. He does success elite, so it will be a top two coming your alley. Triple reds, ooh, he could do damage just Rocky does have triple reds behind him. No cannon shot coming in, which means that no bagger probably has yet. Looks like they're both sitting. Oh no, Landon is nowhere to be found. Maybe he has it. Ooh, uh, he I don't know where he's at. Uh, I can't really see where he's at, but yeah, he might very well have shock. Might be right about that. Um, you see a still top two. If you get top three, uh, he's not really looking back that that much. So, okay, it's not. It was rocked into third. Use gets redded out of second. So, and gets shooting the ball by Fizzy. So, back to two three for HK. But Mike just has his breakaway in first. And Ooh, unless uh, that is something you do not want, because he is not going to make the game. He will not indeed, but he's just going to have to eat this. And if Landon does have shock, there it is. Oh, shock. the first way shock there. And cancels the TC, but nobody does take uh, the box. This is like... be able to resize down here. Hits the Nana out of the cannon, so that's going to uh, put him in eighth now. And, and looking bleak for But he does get Bill in eighth, though, so it might all not all be lost for him. He should be able to get maybe a top five spot with this maybe Landon, uh, he's gonna be forced into this as the bomb there was about to detonate and Ford now is gonna be in last this Bill's gonna get him into fifth maybe four yep fourth and he made a build he made a build uh rock actually out of there it is a top three for le and this stream in third is just gonna steal the deal top three very strong first race from le wow great item great item pulls there from the use which saved him from getting probably last as if he did not have to build that bomb probably would have hit him so that build was saved it saved it for him and along with the clutch shock from landon it's just a gg for hk there there was nothing much they could have done so uh yeah they'll take a commanding lead after after the first race here and landon must have pulled pretty early there because we did see him but because we didn't even see him really at back at the first or after the cannon, uh, right after they exited, so um, right after the runners exited the cannon, so uh, uh, yeah, heads up from heads up play there, good bagging for Landon and a top three seven ten is is how we are going to start out this war on HK's track. I mean, for HK, they really just cannot get down on themselves, especially this early, even though they lost on their own track. They need to, they need to stay level-headed, uh, and try to, tr tr and try to cancel out that race with this next race here. Agreed. So uh, I am back. Sorry, I had to do some deal with some real quick, but uh, yeah. I want to see what. How, how would a sponsor that race, Vinny? Top three seven for Ellie. Top three seven. Ooh, strong start coming out from Ellie. 
we do like to see that coming out because all the momentum is in their favor after match one. Hopefully, it isn't too much of a problem though. On God, and we'll see Ellie going with the DC Wii here and HK going with Peach Gardens. Um, and it will be BC Wii. So, for Ellie, you just want to back immediately here and try to hit as many H of HK as you can. And if you're HK, you just need to shroom up. You need to spam rounds, don't hold anything, and get up here and sap. Uh, we will also ha bring back Ford's POV as he just went live. So, it'll be the use and Ford will be our uh, two POV just match. Oh, it is Ford. Okay. I, I thought that was uh, both were. Uh, uh, I'm not. Sh I think this is still used, I believe. Unless. Uh, yeah, yeah, it, it, is, it is. It is. It is. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So use the golden six at the moment. Uh, four dies there to that. Uh, that green. Um, I imagine. Probably this golden cry be used up at the spiral. It'll be. Oh, he'll he'll use it here. Gotta avoid these greens from Fizzy though. We're just gonna go. Uh, smart to stop going in the first second and is going to find now uh, in second right behind Mike and uh, Buse is going to chain a room in second so he should be able to build on this lead pretty early on. Yeah, they just at least have run top two here from BCB. I'm just need a blue or oh, maybe the red might uh, Nope, it's protection. Yeah, they're just going to get a free run. Teapot coming in. I like this Teapot spot. It's actually not bad. You're getting both of them. They did lose a lot of time up here, but we didn't do much. Blue coming out. Mike going left. Ooh. And that is going to put Mike first. Wow. I don't yeah. miss you. And for, for use, uh, this is going to take him. That power is going to be yeah, after down to third and that blue. I had to avoid that blue. Uh, first dives, though. Think thanks to. Red. Mm. Takes first. Maybe. That's the rocks ahead of him. Let's see if this green. He can connect on this green. So Rock down, hits the a, wall. Oh, I thought there was a blue coming, so he sold that. He hit the wall. Wow. So just, I think nah, he just took the wall. A, a shoot me first. Really bad misplay from Rock there, as they really at, at, at that cost HK is really their only frontal presence Landon there. Landon is running Landon. with them. He either a shock or star. I'm assuming star. Okay, shot. Might try to deke out uh, the bag. Oh, it is. TS. It doesn't work, though. As Wait, I think they had a Mega in second. Nelly does have a Mega in second, so they only TS one of them. The other one dodges in first place. So it looks like now HK would have to scramble for a 2 3 4 here, but it's looking not likely as LE are now 1 3. Yeah. And Ford. Uh, blue shell coming out. A blue wait. Oh, if Ford can combo, maybe this might work out, but if not, he's, that blue's not going to matter. Unless he puts a red here. And he doesn't. T pal. Oh, that's a good T pal. Four, oh, he's in the dirt. Fizzy is. He's gonna gain his spots. So will Mike, but that's his teammate. So that cost Yuska. That cost Yuska a couple of precious spots, though. That was a good T pal that from the last turn from H A. Uh, yeah. yeah. Not a huge race, but it is something that will help them out. It is going to be a winning coming from LE as they get a 1 4 6 8, if I'm not mistaken. 1 4, I think it was 5. 1 4 5, 1 3 5. Um, yeah, it's going to be yeah, 1 4 5, 7. So, another uh, slight winning race from another wing race, slight wing race from. Ellie, Nelly was just too far gone in first for that blue to uh, to make a difference. That mega dodge in second though it was huge. Him him having that dodge and him predicting the obvious TS there. We thought Landon might be able to deke out Dino and take the TS for a youth, but it didn't work because youth did get TS in first still. But uh, it didn't matter as Nelly just got first thanks to dodging that shot. So uh, Le just once again playing really well out of the gates. They I mean, it, they just seem to be on their A game today. They really do. And honestly, if um, Hell's Kitchen was any chance, that they're going to have to just uh, come out with uh, smarter shots. Because that shot right there, it was very obvious. And on top of that, they were able to predict it. And Nubly used his Mega in second, and he just got a free win off of it. So honestly, I think we're going to need to see some more unpredictable shots from Hell's Kitchen if, uh, if they wouldn't have a chance of uh, winning this match. I agree, yeah.
maybe we could have seen a TS on the first ramp or maybe on the half pipes, who knows. But yeah, you are right. They do need some more uh, unpredictable ones. Need to be a little, a little more, a little more uh, uh, edgy with them. But let's see if it happens on BC3 here. Uh, Yus is just going to go itemless for now. With him being in fourth, the red will go past him. Still no item. He's going to go behind the blunt for one. Four dies and pulls triple shrooms. What a pull. You could not pull anything better than that. But the cut will be blocked, though. So uh, Yus is just going to burn one of the shrooms and stay up there. So still a top two at the moment for Elio. Although this red will connect from Snoopy. He has two more of them. But he might just try to back Yus because Nubbly is, is kind of gone. Yeah. He will, but he gets back to himself. Which is gonna give Ellie a top two break here. Nobly burns his shroom in second. I don't really like that play. He wasn't gonna get ready. He could have broken under cracks. He could have a shroom in second. I though, agree. It is. It's an interesting play. But if he wants to back, then it is better. And he does uh, to back him. That was a little bit of a blue lag there. We thought at first he dodged blue, but that wasn't the case. Uh, he hits a nana in first, but it's not really gonna matter too much. It's triple nanas. Should block the cut again. Excuse me. And this cut will. Nah, looks like blocked. that's it's a failed not... block. Yeah, it looks very. Oh, right. yeah. So now people are gonna go going for cut, Ooh, and Mike fails, Mike fails the cut. Ooh. Fizzy makes it second, two, three from HK. Oh, Fizzy goldening up, slams Nubbly into a wall after he gets landed. One, three, four for HK. Really good spots here. Yeah, it's looking good. Um. To see Dino falling off, so maybe Landon has shock. We do see Landon uh, in the corner, hiding away from the runners, which means he probably does have shock. Yeah, Dino is sitting there. I think he's running with a star, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, and if you're Ellie's mid or bottom spots, so just hope you have dodges. You need to be trying to get dodges, as right now it's really just used up there. Shock does come in. We do see someone dodge right behind used. We'll see who that is in a second. Cut is open, so it's open for anyone. We'll see if uh, Ellie. Okay, Nubbly did Nubbly not. Nubbly dies, goes yet. around. And Rock Dude, oh, he fails to cut. All of Ellie makes a cut. Snoopy makes it as well. Yeah, and it should. Looks it's like Ellie like is top two Ellie here. Again. Yes. Nubbly getting triple shrooms. Snoopy dying. This is looking like a top three. Oh, he gets blue uh, online. Wait. Blue does come in then the end. Top two, he shrooms Fizzy off the track. So it is a top three. Wow. Wow. HK, HK just got <laughs> by there at the end. It's a top three after all for LE. It is indeed wow. a top three because since Fizzy is shroomed off the track by Nubbly or or uh, it was Mike, either one. So the blue shell gets canceled and they get an insane race off of it. Wow. I just don't even know what to say. That was huge, huge plays from LE there. They are. Uh, it's, it's watching Rock they're, they're dude coming in fail huge. to cut. Like, you just... Those are just yeah, you don't mistakes want to you see can't that. make. Yeah, mm -hmm. they're going to get top three. Five. five. Wow. Wow. That race hurts one, a lot. And Ellie's starting to break away early on. This is kind of deja vu. What we saw in the last war, where they're just getting these big winning races early on, and HK doesn't really have an answer for it, and they're kind of left scrambling to, to try to get these winning races and try to stop the bleeding and they're just not really having that much success that much of a success of doing that early on but we'll see if we'll see if they can turn around now i feel like they need to they, they need to turn around right now they can't they cannot wait around i know we're only going to race four but they have to get i feel like they have to get a winning race here if they don't get a winning race here i don't know if i have much hope for for uh hk yeah i don't know I do have that's to just me though it is not looking very likely here coming out from HK. This is just not a very good start for them at all. And if they don't change something, mm. it's going to be another blowout. Yep. I no doubt about 100% agree, especially if uh stadium gets picked here a tech heavy track and I think Ellie pretty proficient on it. But HK does get their track pick in Peach Gardens. So that's step 1 into uh, and uh, getting a good race, you have a much better chance of winning this than uh, RWS. So we'll see if we'll, we'll see if HK can turn the tide, turn the tables here. We'll see. Uh, 
Yu's probably just gonna run with Mike in top two. Maybe he pulls a Susui here. Nope. Uh, single red. Single red. It's all good though. It's guards anyway. We used some cut takers. Ward was one of them, but so was so was Snoopy, I believe. So it's looking like a two three for HK at the moment. I believe. Yeah. Okay. Nubly is in first at the moment still. So Ellie still in a pretty decent spot. Although I might like to see Yus drop maybe a first set lap two to try to get shrooms with HK. Is HK is most of the bomb spots. Okay, he pulls triple shrooms here. So he'll just opt to take the cut with this. One of the baggers is gone in 10 too right All now. Right. Uh, we're going to see which one it is in a second. It is Dino in 10. So this could be huge for HK. Looks like top three. <laughs> Wow, everyone's a cut. <laughs> All the time. That's pretty crazy. So we're I, think, gonna... I think almost everyone in the whole all eight players may have taken the cut there, <laughs> at least almost all of them. That's really <laughs> that unheard is impressive. Of. That's but rare. it looks like Ace got the off guard, got the top off of it. They'll be opting to hold these two shrooms and they'll be pulls blue in four. Throws it and dodges. No, no. Subi doesn't dodge it actually. I'm sick, I thought he did. There was just a little bit of blue light there. So now it's uh, LE234, two shrooms and, and four for use. And 4J and is see, in first. Do you see one of the baggers going forwards? I would assume it's, I would imagine might be Dino. We'll find We'll find out in a minute coming up here at the... At Everyone the takes the game. Busy goldening up. Gets right himself into the middle of the pack of reds. Mike misses. Mike's forced to go around. 4J in a ground star from Dino, which means that Ellie probably does have shot. Use opting to use a shroom there. The land up holding nine, I guess. There, we'll see if we'll see. Yep, shock does come in. Shock I would have I I figured it was coming in. I don't know who that favored though. Hopefully, it's Ellie. I think it, it was primarily a shock in the boxes, but I think yeah, Ellie is getting the best, the better of that. From and the looks they of are it. getting. I'm gonna say two, three, four. Okay. I L couldn't really tell exactly what spots they got, but it kind of looks to be mixed spots, kind of. Yeah, I know that it might have been a two, three, four. I think it's a two, three, four. Unfortunate for Dino though, didn't that he wasn't able to pull Shock there is he wasn't ten. I guess Landon just got that a nine, and uh, and Dino did a smart play of going to drop a star to change the jump section for HK. We did see Ford get that ground star. And which netted him first place at yes. the end. Two three four, yep, two three four seven nine for Ellie. So HK was not able to get it to get a winning race after all, even on their own track pick, and Ellie just still increasing that lead. Still not looking good for H for HK. Nope, not at all. I don't know, man. It's kind of getting the same vibes as the previous war. Ellie's just dominating early on, and they don't seem to be letting up at all. Um, so it's very unfortunate to start. It looks like they are now down 54 after 4. That is not the greatest start to a GP. If I am else catching him. Score is going to be 149 to 95. Going to race 5. Honestly, it's still not yeah. over yet, Vinny. I have faith it's that they not, will fall it's back. Not. I, I can see it. They've done it before in the past, where they've been down and they came back. So honestly, I do think that this match still will be close. I'm not giving up yet. So let's, we'll see. Yeah, I'm not giving up it, it either. I know, I, I, I definitely know HK is capable of pulling off, of pulling off comeback for sure. They're definitely not out of it. They have the runners to do it. They have uh, the backers as well. Dino, very capable of getting, of getting um the shocks too. So yeah, they're definitely not out. But uh. I need to start happening soon here, and we hope it's on this track to DKJP. I want to see Ford run it up in first and back uh, use here with this green. Hopefully he can get the screen to connect, maybe do a little bit of back backing out of cannon, although he's not really in the alignment to do that. Uh, we see Deacon coming up here, two, three of these for Ellie. This red is just going to break on that green. Um, Thinking about pretty even right now. Someone's getting redded in the off-road. Couldn't really tell who that was. Um, just the Snoopy trying to come, trying to make his way up here, trying to come up, and he'll try to back, back spam two him. Two fibs on the bridge. Looks like he did. He got to go on the right of that. And it uh, looks like they're going to be 2-3 right now. He's chilling after lap one. 4G does hold his first. 
which is really good on this map. And Soupy Goldening up, getting the second place. Ooh, ooh, triple shrooms and four. If you'd love to see that, that is a very good feeling. He could do some He's damage. having to play with the items he is, he here. Could, he could, uh, if, he, if he wants to play his cards, right, he could aggress the first right now if he wanted to. But I think he's just going to opt to hold these. You know, see if he knows it. And yes, he does. Probably, uh, he's probably a smart one. Probably just going to hold these for the cut, get some first off of it. Yeah, that'd probably be, uh, that'd be the... Spartus play. He needs to be wary of these nanas from uh, Snoopy. If I'm Snoopy, Nana's I would I would have spammed the bridge here. Oh, you could back that right in the middle. It seems he threw up the green forwards by accident. But uh, yeah, mm -hmm. he's, he's gonna. Oh, what? Did you see that, Vinny? The green. How did he? <laughs> How did he avoid that? How did he avoid that, that green? Is that was so like... lucky. Literally, he avoided it the first time by the inch of hair, and then like it came back and he avoided it barely again. That, <laughs> that was, was really touching lucky. like treads of his tire and the shot in, the which is gonna dodge. dodge. Top two dodges in cannon. Actually, no, that was so, a bagger uh, in a second. That was Dino in a second. That's a bagger. Oh, so okay. okay. So it only dodges. So it only dodges a use. So yeah, he's just gone in first now. This should be a first place for use. His actually does connect on second place. Uh, yeah, it's looking like he's getting first here and hope that that uh, HK is all behind him for HK's sake. They need to just play for two, three, four, or two, three, five here. The mid pack behind him is pretty tight. You might see him trap this turn up here. Nope. No, he doesn't. I might have, I might have, I might have put a tight fit there to be honest. Until, because because you can tell your you can tell your other players just go up there, but maybe trap the end of cut there and see if HK hits it if they take cut there. I don't know. Maybe that's just me though. But that was a I don't know how that green didn't hit him either, but he somehow avoided Snoopy almost. It, it almost turned out to work. Him throwing that green by him accidentally throwing that green four instead of back. It almost worked in his favor, but. Almost. I don't know. Hit, hit. Um, we are gonna see what spots he got in, and it's a one, three, six, eight from Ellie. I' pretty sure that's winning. I'm not one hundred percent sure. One three. Six, it is. I believe it is by maybe just one. No, I'm not uh, completely sure, but it, barely. It is winning. Barely. It's winning by. by uh, Winning by one. Maybe like Dino got nine. Just one. Winning yeah. By one. And but that's just another winning race from Elliot. I'm just not seeing anything up from HK right now. This is not looking good. Yeah. At this point, for for Ellie, you can afford to just have these kind of mediocre races. races. Exactly. Because you're up by so much. As long as you keep this lead, you're fine. What are you doing if you're in HK's position right now, Vinny? <laughs> if I'm in HK's position. I mean, we just need a luck track to reset. We need to get another kind of a Peach Gardens-esque track, but they're not going this. They're going RBC, it looks like. But, like, they need their track pick, and they need to change their game plan and to try to do a better job of maybe just... If they're holding items, they need to use them to get up there. It just doesn't seem like they're up there a whole lot. LE seems to be occupying first place a lot of the time. So I feel like for HK, you just got to spam your shrooms maybe spam your dodges even you know like rather than holding them but i just changed the game plan around is what i would do because you gotta try something out because because it's desperation time it is desperation time, especially in finals this is where you gotta bring everything out this is it this is it right here this is the final match that decides everything and bring out all your stops hopefully we can see something coming out from hk here because uh we do not want to see a blow up in the finals match that does not right seem very interesting and, uh, exactly. Right. Looks like the track is picked is RBC. We are gonna see. We start on the first. No drafters. Rock to the second. You see me? I would have insta back that green because I'm a little greedy, but it ended up working out because you yeah. see a bomb coming out, just getting rid of Rock Dude who shroomed into the green shell, and Us is just gone in first. This is really good. Up oh, the wall hit. Really leave. The wall hit. The wall bay doesn't lose much speed at all. I like to see him start backing a little bit here, and maybe if if Ellie, I think I saw Mike behind him. I like to double back. I mean, I like to back the wide yeah, line there because you, of the shroom. Yeah, yeah. And that gets his own nana hits his backer, but it's all right. Maybe he puts a fib. Maybe if he tight. Throw, I would. Maybe fibs throw. usually hit most at the top there, but he decides to hold it. Doesn't decide to get another box, which could, which is not a smart play at all. Because if second pulls are red, you are ready behind the street. But he ends decides he to just block, block the rail around. though. Fizzy looks like he doesn't have a red, so he will be fine. But uh, yeah. HK two three four or five. I think they're two three five right now. It looks like two three five. They are behind him. Man, I tell you, this is gonna back everything. 
I would like to see some unpredictable backs games come from him, though. Those are the ones that usually hit the most. He's just not going to hit a box, which is something that you don't want to do. Prioritizing lines over boxes, especially his first one. Like, you know the other team's second. You just got to, like, keep backing to get him out. But uh, early shock, about two. 125 coming out. I think it was an Ellie shot. And we're probably going to see him up. Still a big break for uh, Yuskin first. We can't really see... We can't really see what's going on in the mid pack, who dodged and who and who didn't. So we're kind of just going off, I guess, a whim here. Hopefully. As um, I mean, it's just you gotta hope that he uses a little it. bit boring. A little bit of a rear view here, moment. Let's, let's see who's behind you. Hot dodge? Uh, he's not built like that. Oh. Yep, top two blue coming out though. So this will change up things a little bit. It's gonna bring him closer to the pack. He should still be in first after this blue as Nubly is still here to protect him and in second Landon right now. Landon is still in 10. So, oh, he has his own back stamps has... on his last oh, lap. That's that, something you can't that do. Is There's the can't worst feeling. Trap. Looks like the red skips yeah. him though, so he gets kind of lucky there. 4J Four in second. Hell's Kitchen behind. are in good spots. One blue here just could change a lot. Thin middle gets him. Rod Dude also gets him. Like, Soupy Hell's Kitchen. There's 2 3 4. Shock and set from Ellie, maybe? No. Ford goes through the boxes. I mean, not Ford. Oost goes through the boxes. Deacon's starring up. I think they have, because Deacon's in because Deacon's in a star. I feel like they would have used if they, they, they had. So I guess used. no one has shot. Might be shot close. But HK could be getting a good race. Uh, here. Maybe if they could get. I guess they're probably getting 2 3 here. Yeah, unless Deacon has something oh, up his sleeve. Oh, T-Bell. That's going to kill Yusk. Yeah. 2 3. He Wait, Deacon died. Wait, that's a 2 3 4. That is a winning race. Two, three, four, six. six. Nice. Wow. Yeah. The, hey, that might be the momentum they need. Two, three, Could four, six. Be, Could it be a turning point in the war? Could this be the time that HK finally makes a run and starts getting uh, some good races and chains and chains some winning races now? That two, three, four, six is what you wanted there uh, on their track pick. This was their track pick, so they they do finally get a winning race. Of what seems like forever ago. And Dino gets nine as oh, well. Oh, Deacon ends up beating Rock Dude, so it's actually a two, three, five, six coming out. Oh, and not as not as good as we thought, but it's still a plus five. But it is still a winning HK. race, which means that is their first winning race of this match, which means that momentum might be shifted. Who knows? Who knows indeed? And they still have they still have a whole like the six six races, I believe seven. Uh, looks like we're going to win. That was race, race six right there, so we are going to race seven. So, so we have yeah. six left. Okay, we are, we yeah. are at the halfway point, so. down 50. If I'm HK, I am going to just forget about the last six races and just go strong these last six right here. Like I said, mm -hmm. this, these, this is, these are the most important six matches of your of your marker week career right now. You're in the finals, you know? Right. You got to put everything right. on the line. You got to start fresh and... And, and and kind of just tell yourself you're starting the war over. It's just a six race war, and you know, while well, you're starting at a 50 point handicap, so yep. just play just play for your that's, lives right now. That, that's that's just two star trolls and uh, a bump a bump into an item. You know, <laughs> that's all the 50. Yep, and you're back in. You're back in. <laughs> back. <laughs> Maybe Landon does a little bit of trolling. Who knows? And hopefully you're recording. HK does get the track pick RWS and. Well, you pick this track, so you have to have to stay up there if you're HK. You can't die here on a track like He's RWS a where it's very technical. Only a single show, but that's still good. You can just you can just take cut here and probably get into first. We see Ford in second at the moment. Right, right uh, side. Took that a little slow, but it's fine. Fizzy, my, I'm fizzy. I'm gonna go for the stop mega here. Nope, doesn't get it. Probably got him on his screen, but it's live. Yeah, <laughs> wisely. Uh, He's just went wide there to avoid that stop troll at all costs. Nubbly in second right now. Green snipe attempt is not going to connect on Fizzy. And maybe Fizzy backs this last turn here. Or maybe backs on the ramp. We'll see. Yeah, the back. That doesn't And connect. there goes the green that was supposed <laughs> to hit him. That was the green that was supposed to hit him on DK Jungle Parkway. Finally got him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Finally, Carmen comes around and gets <laughs> gets the use, but. Uh, this red should connect on Ford. Oh, it almost hit. Almost hit himself. Almost hit you. Yeah. He's not opting to go for the box there. It's just something that uh, kind of confuses me. I kind of would have went for a box four there, but it's on him. HK, 134 here. 134, 8, I'm assuming. We don't know the bagging battle just yet. 
Both legs are still going backward, but one is uh, gone in 10 right now. We're not exactly sure who that is, but we'll see if we can get a little bit of a mini map sneak peek up here. But it's looking like a shock might get hold, whoever does have until the lap three, maybe to TS. As shock is very, very powerful on this track, that TS is just so nasty if it just ends races. So, but these triple shrooms could be big for use here. Takes a better wall bounce there. It's gonna take cut. It's still gonna be back back here. Looking What's like the uh, two, three. One in the back is zip pull it here. It's looking like I think Landon has it because I seen a uh, Dino fall off the track. I'm pretty sure Landon has shock here, so we might see an Ellie shot coming out. T pow. Oh. Oh, that T pow is really bad. It also kills used. We might be seeing a shot coming shot. out here. Maybe. Opting to hold. No shock. No shock. No shock. So either it wasn't pulled or it just they ended up holding it. But Yus is going to get the worst of that target pal, honestly. Getting he gets eight, eight off, off of it. That. Because, all because of one to second hitting that banana. He gets eighth instead of third. I mean, he's gonna get there. Yeah. And I'm not sure exactly what spots HK got. No clue. Chance but I think that they got a good race. I'm going to. It looks like it from the looks. I think Fizzy got first. That would be huge then. If. uh. If Izzy did get hit in DD at first, we'll see. And they get a top three top six! Three. <laughs> that is the race HK needs! They are coming back into this. We are going to have a close match, folks. There we go. That is, and just like that. That is what they needed. Exactly. That is exactly, exactly what, what they, they needed, needed right there. The top three six on their track pick. I'm telling you, th these back to back races, they've won it now. So perhaps it's a chain reaction and they just start getting all these winning races and come back in this match who knows hk is but feeling it's the, the adrenaline they're, they're getting the blood flow up this is it they're coming they're, they're, they're saying hey don't count us don't count us out yet we're not over you know they're only down by 27 only now. 27 only 27, 27 point deficit that is one race that is a top four or a top three five Vinny. that's all it is they are nowhere exactly, near out that of this. Is all it. it is a one race deficit right now. This finals can go either way. Match three. Here we go, Vinny. This is exactly what we came for right here. This is what you want to see. This is what you want to see exactly. I mean, 27 is nothing. If you're HK, 27 is nothing compared to a down by like 50, 60 points. Let's see if they don't. They do not get their tribe though. It will be Grumble Volcano. I, I really wanted to see DK Mountain. I do want I wanted to see, to see DK what Mountain. they could have done on there. Yeah. What could they have done? But it will be GV. I ideally probably top two runs. Then you'd have your three and your six drop here to try to get some shrooms. Who knows? Maybe second can pull shrooms as well. But uh, this isn't this isn't bad for HK. They still can they still can make do with what they have here. Yusuke is gonna just go for the box and get triple greens. Rock two gonna break that red there. Maybe uh, yeah, Yusuke can't really do much with these greens right now. Mike and um, I believe. Uh, is just all around him. Top two at the moment for HK. Rock is going to hit dirt, I guess. And Mike's going to take over. Actually, the Deacon's going to take over. And he's going to go for the Rock Hop. And he will he make it. it. Nice, easily. Looks like he's going around. He might have made it with the Golden. Which would give him a huge break in first. And Maybe. He is. Yeah. It will be 2 3 4 though for HK, but uh, that's a, gets triple shrooms. That's shrooms a sign the there. Is. <laughs> 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 I don't think we want to hit that there, but it's fine. So we're good. He has two shrooms left. Yeah. Opting for the shortcut holding. Someone is in Bill. We've seen a, a good amount of Bills in play. Uh, Both baggers uh, going, going forward, forward now, so someone pulled. I'm uh, guessing the one in front has. We have no idea. We're going to see a Reese one coming here. Someone's in Mega. Oh, it's definitely an Ellie shock. He's only a respawn. It's coming now. I would assume it's coming. No. I don't think so. Yeah, no. No maybe, shot. I guess maybe they thought that right. HK had it. I'm so confused. Okay. We're going to figure this out. I don't know. Dino I, is I, right there. Someone definitely has. So I think Landon has. I think Landon has it. Use trailing this bomb is going to just break the red on this. and He does hit someone with that bomb just by a little bit triple reds uh, it's still damage. two three for hk ford probably gonna get redded here he is yep, Rocky, that red cut, they called a ts or did he make it he got ts uh, he did not make it he got ellie TS. calling a ts He's top two mike coming mike, in uh, there top, top three. three. Oh, this is not looking good at all it's gonna be a big race for ellie again here this is gonna undo everything it that is. hk did the last race period although it is it's it's a top three white. Top three, yep. Wow. Just like that.
it's That's back it's back in ellie's favor i mean that pretty much just completely cancels out that rws race and if you're hk you're just you're just defeated after that you had all the momentum you were feeling great and then and then just unfortunately like that. they didn't get their track pick ellie got the shock there and they just couldn't do couldn't do much i feel like they were just gonna they're gonna lose ours anyway rock would have probably gotten first if had it not been for that uh target shock there yeah top three eight nine for le so plus 23 i want to say 21 and 23. yeah it's looking like a plus 19 race there oh. that's very unfortunate but it's not the end they're only down 46. Yeah, it's not the end there. Only 46. Yeah. Four races left. Still got time. Still got a GP left to go. But man, that race just kills you if you're HK there. That just, that's just a dagger. It is, it you is. gotta shake it off here. And you gotta try to balance back. But can't help but feel pretty defeated probably after that. Because that was just, that was just tough. We'll see what they opt to go for here. Ellie is going to pick Moonview Highway here, and HK is going to go for MC3. Some pretty good, pretty standard traffic here for these spots, I feel like. You already used BC Weave for the top three, so Moonview is probably your next best option if you're HK. You're hoping the Dino can get shock if it's MC3, and maybe hoping for like a triple dodge, perhaps. It will be Moonview Highway, though, so Ellie gets get another track pick again. Uh... And we'll see, these track picks haven't been kind to HK for the last two races. They haven't, but, but no excuse. Still should. Yeah, no it's excuse still should perform, you know? Everyone plays the same 32 tracks in the game. It's just unfortunate that their positions are going to be bad for it. But they can get up That's there. That's right. Hopefully, you just got to have the item luck. Ooh, a bomb. Uh, he, I would instantly back this. Uh, Nubby's man in a mega? I, yeah, I, I guess. Yeah, I guess Ellie's right behind him is... Well, to be fair, Pax stupid because if he backs us, like, five people are even dying, if, probably But even if die. you, um... Look, if he backs it right there, even with his teammate there, you're giving you... Because they're already top two, right? They're giving yeah. the top two gone, and then you're third, right? So basically, you guys are going to be top three going. And he just runs into a bomb car. Use, <laughs> use kids two bomb cars in a row there is now going to be in sixth place after Ellie did start out. Top three. So if he hits a car though, that is a bad misplay. He's going to really get bad. punished for As that. There's only one H in the rough band. It is Rock, dude. It looks like he's in like second or third. And the pack is split. Very split. Although Nubbly hit a car, I believe. So, uh, pass gonna, this top three is just going to be uh, very spread now. But that favors LE. Is LE, I believe, is maybe 1 3. I think Rocks. Or maybe he's up. Uh, right now might Ooh. be top two actually for le all right he just gets back ridded there and this is the boost panel gonna have to back up for it and it's gonna be eighth but he's surrounded by eight <laughs> eight he gets hit another, <laughs> is that another car hit <laughs> it's kind of funny i think he got back redded i, oh, I think that was okay. red uh hit him yeah uh still pretty much equally just as bad as uh, uh dino has the shot dino does have the shot he is sitting up there but I think the fact is too split that like it won't even do much. It won't. Not unless. Unless Ford and Fizzy, uh, one of them have to like pull a mega yeah. here. Ford got TC, yeah. yeah. It just it won't do anything. A dodge here doesn't do anything unless they pull something right now. But gotta even maybe call into boost panels, maybe into boxes, or just something, anything. I don't know. Okay, Snoopy bumps uh, used out of the way of the box. Used will be getting it. No shock is gonna get used. I. I don't know if I really agree with that. I feel like you had to try at least something. Fizzy dies on the line and gets seven. Uh, Shock now gets used. Uh, but that's, once again, just not good for HK. They let, they I mean, they just let top run, even though youth did die there. Still, they kept top two, Mike. And uh, that was, I, I think that was Nubbly that was up there with them. Top two just ran, pretty much. Rock couldn't, could not get those top two out and, of there. Oh, he gets third. Yep. It was, Deacon, Nubby does get for us a top two for, for uh, Ellie, and once again, it is looking bad for HK. It's looking coming really down bad to the now. wire here. Extremely bad. Uh, this is just not good now, because now you have three races left and you're down 60, which means you need three big races in order to win this thing. It is looking very unlikely yeah. for this kitchen now. Indeed it is. Indeed it is. 
we'll see what we'll see if they can make kind of a hail mary hail mary comeback here but i can't imagine the morale in the call is is pretty high right now it's probably pretty low which is even more of a disaster and the morale in le is probably really high uh so i don't know yeah i'd Looking imagine like i'd imagine like le is lose. feeling very confident going to these last two races as they do see a foreseeable victory in the future i feel like if they get tf here this is gonna it's gonna be nice as possible for AJK to get a winning race here is They've they've been so consistent up in the spots. Ellie has, but they do get MC3 though. They do get the Finally, track they pick. get a track again. So who knows? HK needs to hopefully just pull some dodges. Dino gets shock and maybe do a triple dodge, uh, triple dodge to win. If I were you, though, I would back for this eighth place box. You're up by so much. I would okay. He obviously gets fifth. I would I would have dropped personally to get that eighth place for his just to made HK suffer and not let him get that Aether since you're up by so much, but Sega gets triple greens and kills Rot Dude. Uh, tries snipe. to snipe forward. Oh, so he's gonna go for it again. I think he threw a little too early. Good example. Or gets Nana though, eats that Nana, and Fizzy in a mega is gonna take forward spot in second place right now. You see Pac starting to split just a little bit in the top three. Nano snipe is not gonna not gonna be strong enough to connect. Uh he's just having He's holding this red right now. Could, it, it, if he uses it at the cut, could get Fizzy with a side red. Or is it going to red Rock Dude right here? Fizzy, Fizzy getting gets back to out. three greens around him, though. And then Rock Dude Rock getting dies. hit. Mike getting hit. Wow. And so now Ooze takes first. Like <laughs> Everyone <that>. dying there. <laughs> but the pack is really close, though. You see how close this pack is. Both bag are still going backwards. It, it is Dino in 10 right now. I don't know if he has... Maybe he just pulled there. Uh, but for, for HK's sake, Dino has to pull shock here, and the okay, Nubly gets into first, so it's yeah, top two. It's but top two. It just needs to shock him. He doesn't Dino have didn't. Yeah, he doesn't have. It's going to have to come on a spam shock for HK here. We see some cut takers. Someone's in a star. Someone's in a yeah, mega. It's just a free top two. Top, top three. Two. Top three, five. Or that's, that might be top four. Maybe. Well, I think it was either top three, five, or top four there. That that just might very well be the final. Don't look up in there. I think, I think that's the finals there. That, that might be D six, right there. We'll confirm in a second exactly what they get. But HK could not do it on their track. They couldn't get shock. I they just couldn't get dodges. I guess they couldn't hit top two out. Rock dude, we saw him die a couple of times. Unfortunately, up there. So did Ford. He was really their only hope. But uh. Top three, yeah, top three, five, top three, five, nine. That's a plus 27, seven, yeah, plus 27. So that's pretty much GG's. It's pretty much the final nail in the coffin. It's looking, it's looking like Ellie is going to be crowned Division Six champions and we'll get their banner, it would appear. So it uh, sucks that it has to end so early. I wish, really wish for a closer match, but hey, it happens. Yeah, it's it does it happen. Yeah, Gotta right. give credit to, eight, to LE. They played extremely well. They are playing extremely that, well the second match. Like, it was a double double blow up from them. So, mm -hmm. that's what it is. They were on their A game, and HK didn't really have an answer for them, it seems. Weren't up there enough. Uh, Not just... I feel like they just maybe held their arms a little too much and kind of maybe rely on shock just a little bit too much because... Well, and when they did get up there, Ellie just did a great job of hitting them out. So that's just kind of been the moral of the story, yeah, and it yeah. it's been very commanding. But at least this overall is playing better. Be they, proud. They're both they both should be yeah. proud of getting this far. Yeah, but no doubt about it. Both, both, both have they both came out today, and Ellie just showed that they were just a better team at, at the end of the day. Unfortunately, so hopefully, uh, just, maybe maybe next season you can have a little, a little rematch. Maybe because uh, I think Ellie should be getting moved up to D5 if they do run it back next season. And then uh, who knows what happens with HK and their roster. Indeed. I hope and, and I hope uh, both teams do come back because both teams have so much to look forward to as well. If you're HK, you'd probably stay in D6 again. Ellie would go up to D5 where I think they would they would play well. They, they uh, would have some good, some tough competition, but I think they'd be up for the challenge. If you're HK, definitely can come back and play for a banner again. 
but they shouldn't feel discouraged because they both they're both here for a reason. They played exceptionally well this season and both should and, and both should have stuff to look forward to, but also stuff to work on for next season too. And the off season is just time to practice, time to just improve. Because there's always room for improvement. Yes. Always room for improvement. There's always room for improvement. And we are seeing an all run here. Which means that this is just basically just a room right now, unfortunately. But uh Yeah, it is what it is. I guess we're gonna have a little bit of fun for these last few races. As LE Bass and different three. Ooh, good cycle out there from Moose. Back into first he goes. See if he can keep it here. See maybe some some fun jock usages. That is a scary scary shoes. He makes them. Misses the low trick. All good though. We're just working on our lines right now. Shot coming in from <laughs> I have no clue. <laughs> I don't think anyone dodged that. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I think yeah. Jeez, it's just looking God. like it's looking like you can just we're just doing a little bit of trolling. That's about it. No, oh, we do a little bit of trolling indeed. <laughs> and, and imagine trolling in finals. That's kind of funny. That would be that would be hilarious, hilarious indeed. But it's all in good fun now. It's fairly tight too. Oh, use kids a uh, banana hidden by the blooper, but his teammate Landon takes over first, maybe. There's a little bit of team killing here. Another shroom list is gonna be made from and Landon, only one, I guess. Or no, Landon made it, but he's just right he's next to the Yeah, he's just lagging a little bit. But there we go. Looks like we got a top two coming up from Ellie. I can try to see if we can get them to interview, potentially. I can ask in chat, maybe we can interview with Ellie here at the end. Uh, yeah, of course, we can ask him. And yeah, they're gonna get top three out there, as usual. Okay. Yeah, we'll we'll find out in just a little bit if if they will do that if they respond in chat. But we'll just be playing out this last race now here. And once again, I want to give a congrats to. Uh, to luminescence for winning d6 they earned it and they can enjoy it. they hopefully they go enjoy their their banner now they did, did it i don't uh, i can't speak i don't remember if they won it last no they actually they lost in playoffs last season i do remember they uh, lost in semifinals so this is a very good feeling for them knowing that they actually made it all the way through this time so i bet they are very excited right now indeed indeed they go celebrating call have the right to celebrate all in good all in good fun and the last try will be gcn a mario circuit i was kind of hoping for shy guy beach low key but this will do <laughs> <laughs> this will do Bump into the grass from use to the green pole. Rock dude able to pass this TC off. And it's gonna force the person to use the or no bill usage anyway. But Dino ends up with the TC, unfortunately. If someone just build up to get up there, Snoopy tries <laughs> to stop the shot side. This is up. Does force just to use his golden off, so I guess it works a little bit. A Ford is in first currently. Let's see if he can get CP versus this race and off on a high note perhaps I'd like to I'd like to see this Nana Snipe from Yusk land here go for the niche Landon and Null they both take cuts so Ford loses that first GCNMC I figured that would happen anyways see quite a few cut takers the triple reds is going to be pulled here just to add some salt to the wound Ford's probably going to die here in a second uh, blue <laughs> Let me get ready. blue devastating Red connects. Top two for LE again. Landon running it up in first. Bagman running when the bag runs, they say. <laughs> and this room pull here. Just a little icing on the cake. Perfectly done, Chuck. Makes the cut. Nice. Only to get blue 10 seconds after. Wait for it. 
<laughs> Maybe we'll do shock. Although, uh, I don't think anyone has at the moment. Should be a first here for these. And the final turn, and champions. Just like that. Close it out. Looks like a looks like it was top two. I think Layman got second. It's officially over. Hey, what's up, Yuse? There he goes. Man of the hour. Oh uh, well. What is, up? what is up? So good. How are you doing? We will be getting I'm one doing more person. Landon Absolutely well. fantastic. Thank you very much. How are you feeling uh, about this 2-1 uh, victory coming out of this? Well, I'm going to be honest with you, Will. I was very nervous after match one. You know, my team, uh, we had a little bit of some difficulties match one. Couldn't really get the players in on their scheduled times. You know, we ended up forfeiting. And then after that, I told my team after that loss that we need to get our stuff together. Yes. And quite frankly... I feel like we did a great job of doing that. I feel like we were on fire. We were on point. Everyone got together. We huddled up. We were like, just got to get the job done. We got to bring it home. Indeed. Because at the end of the day, guess what? We did what we you had to do. You are the champion. We did, we did indeed. <laughs> you did what you had to do. it, And you all played extremely well. Like we were, Me and Will were talking about it on the cast. How you guys were just up there all the time and commanding those top spots and playing exceptionally well and hitting HK out when they did try to get up. And they did now we there. have Landon in here as well. Yo, absolutely what's good, Landon. What is up, Landon? It's my man right there. What's good, Landon? How you feeling, yeah. man? How you feeling, Landon? I saw you run match too. How'd that feel? Yeah. Uh, I didn't run match too, though. Did you? Did you not? Oh, sorry. No, no, no. I was going. I was going to because Deacon was. And my and then he showed up. So. Oh, okay, okay. Never mind then. Well, at least you have to run these last two matches, you know. Uh, yeah. But uh, yeah, how do you feel about this uh, victory, Landon? Pretty good. I didn't think we were gonna even make semis, so it feels nice. Nice, nice. Very hey, well that's what's up. That's what's up. You made you made it a lot farther than you think that than you thought you would. That, that probably makes the that's gotta make the victory even sweeter, doesn't it? Hundred percent. You out when you outplay your expectations, you set goals, and you do a lot better, and. Yeah, you, I mean, you guys are the champions, Division Division 6, after a long, hard-fought season. Uh, yeah. Did you guys face any pressure going into the third match? Like, what were you guys' thoughts after taking the second match and going into the winner-take-all? Well, I mean, after the first match, we were kind of nervous because nothing really went well. You know, I wasn't able to show up, and we kind of had to put out a subpar LU, and we lost pretty bad. But then um, after HK had some issues for match two, we kind of... Got back on the road and got our motivation back to take a home match three. Oh, nice. Damn. Nice. That is really nice to hear. So, uh, should we be expecting big things coming from Ellie, uh, GSC Season 5? Yes or no? Yeah, we're running it back, hopefully. And, I mean, I mean, Yusk wants to push D5. I don't know about that. I mean, you just won D6. Of course you want to push yeah, D5. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we might, we might pick up Monty again, so that would be a good addition to the roster. Ooh, and yeah. we're keeping Nubly and... We're keeping the the core. The main. If you're keeping the, the core, core, then yeah. you're gonna get moved up, of course. Yeah, we're probably we're probably gonna try D5. See what's up with D5. It'll, it'll, be, it'll yeah. be fun. It'll be it'll be a challenge, you know. But I think you guys can yeah. uh, farewell. I mean, if you won D6, you can definitely farewell on D5. So. Yeah. Oh no, not about it. You guys would be well equipped to hand equipped to handle D5, especially if you do indeed pick up Monty. He's he'd be a really good addition again. Yeah. For sure. But I'm glad you guys are gonna run it back. I I really hope. I really hope. Uh, that HK runs it back too, because still, you guys, all of you guys, everyone has a lot to play, play for. Yeah. But yeah, definitely wish you guys good luck in D5. Uh, uh, I, I, I guess I'll ask you guys what, uh, how are you guys feeling, kind of midway for the war? I'll say after HK got top three, uh, I think it was six on RWS. You guys, the lead was cut down to 27. How'd you guys, how'd you guys feel, or how'd you guys attack the last? couple of races because i saw you guys got big winning races right after it so yeah the mentality so, and call change at all yeah so after they got the top three we kind of just we kind of just brushed it off pulled ourselves back together and just played the next race really well got the shock made a good call and won the race nice just kind of forgetting about the the bad race and just moving on you know of course that's what you have to do exactly move past the bad races right, go to the next one 
I think that's what uh, I also I try to tell my guys after a bad race that it's not over till it's over. So exactly. we just got to gear up, get back together, you know, try to put together somewhat of a winning race, even if it is a small winning race, like a one, three, five or something. But at the end of the day, we just got to win those races after like a big loss in points, like a top three on RWS. So honestly, I feel like my team really, you know, came out to play you know what i mean they really showed up when they needed to the most and you know hence the result so i'm very proud of them no doubt about it yeah i mean that uh, that's, that's the mentality you have to have in in a finals match and winner take all because if you let the moment get too big uh it's just gonna it's gonna eat you up and you guys you probably start playing bad hk probably builds off of that and gets to the big races so to stay calm level headed and keep your guys in it definitely the way to go for sure yep. absolutely 100%. but uh i just want to end off um me saying this because i was really hyped after winning the finals but to the rest of the people watching you got that what he got that what he got that dog in a baby yeah <laughs> that's why i like this <laughs> hey, baby. all right but uh honestly you guys are great i appreciate it and uh Thank you so much for your interview. No problem. Thank you so Thank much. You. Any final yeah, words, no Landon? Problem. Any final words, Landon? Nope. No? Just GG's. Nice. All right. Cool. See you later. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Well, that's probably going to do it for us, mostly. If you, don't, you guys don't got anything else to say, it's probably going to end the stream and conclude Division 6 Finals. Uh, on behalf of MK Central Wii, I'm Vinny. And I'm Maxwell. I'm the use. And we will be seeing you guys.